Hello everyone and welcome back to Simon Plays. I'm Simon and I'm playing more Resident Evil 8. Where we're probably gonna be fighting Sturm. Or however it's called, right? Making so much dust. Okay, I'm guessing one more. Or. Oh no! What's that? I thought he was dying or something, you know? But he's gone on overdrive. Oh no 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 no! The hell away from me! Oh no 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 no! God damn it! Come on, charge me, charge me! What is he even doing? Charge! Let me kill him? Oof. Come on. I'm guessing he's gonna try to burn me again. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, I'm stuck here. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, come on. What is it? Oh, come on. You're not giving me a chance. No, this is not possible. Come on. Come on. Yeah, that was a charge I could use to attack him. But I didn't. Oh no, I missed. Threw away 2.5 thousand damage. Oh no! I don't even need the dash. If I do it right. Now stay down. Okay, he's dead. Is he? Yeah. Okay. 
complex mechanical car. Okay. There's more stuff in this room, so let's try to find it. Probably some more ammo hanging around. Yeah, that was it. And we once again have tons of handgun ammunition. Oh, a cigar. I guess that's a uh, treasure. Cigar made in Cuba. It's really dumb. Miranda is abominable. Her deceit knows no bounds. We're merely a bunch of failed Kadu experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the other poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive you for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't just change my body, she took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. What does he mean? Like, she gave you superpowers. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anyone using the mega mindset. The trick is that Barat Rose, if I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of, the kid's dad, Ethan, has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. So if you don't know what's happening, you're thinking that Heisenberg is attracted to Ethan, but it's definitely not the case. That's not what he means by very interesting body. Wait, so I'm guessing this is the way forward. So let's go here first. See what we can find. An herb, some chem fluids, some scrap, some shotgun ammo. Okay. This looks like another boss fight, doesn't it? <laughs> but this doesn't seem to be... Oh god, I need to sneeze. Sorry guys. Oh, okay. It went away. Good, good. Ah, very safe. Oh, God. Hiccups. Hiccups, sneezes. I don't know what's up with me today. My throat. <coughs> and then. I'm sorry if that's too loud. I'm trying. Nothing? Okay, actually, nothing. Just a tractor here. How do you get the tractor in here? Beats me. Oh, we're back at the entrance. What the? <laughs> he just blocked the steel beam with his hand. So stylish. So stay out of <laughs> yeah, shoot the metal one. 
Not go away. Ethan is sometimes either too dumb or too desperate. Jim, again? Yeah, again at the bottom. Like, this guy controls metals, obviously, with his mind. Why are you trying to shoot him? It's not gonna work. With a handgun, especially. Maybe something with uh, more velocity would work, but a handgun? <laughs> I told you to leave it alone, Ethan! You are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Yeah. I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Civilians. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? I owe you an explanation. Hand me that wrench. Should have just told him from the start. Game would be very different. Like half of it is redundant. If only if I knew. Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of Crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. It might not be true. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get it, Ethan. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. <laughs> I will stay down here and finish planting explosives. You take that elevator, I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight. Find Miranda. She's a dead woman. All right, Ethan. That's why. And you take this and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. So he could have told us from the first moment, like Ethan, that was not Can't Mia. That was not your wife. That was a crazy woman that's trying to steal your daughter. So let's uh, go run some tests, see if you and Rose are okay, and then we'll go find her. Different game. Ah, well, whatever. He decided not to tell us. To Hound Wolf Squad, the sweep of the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments, which supports our previous theories. 
She seems to have infected herself with a mutamycid, which has granted her a number of abilities, including mimicry. She can control her, her cells and transform herself to look like anyone or anything. She disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winterseas home. Her objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. Like, it's a baby. It doesn't understand. When we attacked it, put a little damper on her plan so she mimicked the corpse. She then revived herself in the transport track, killed everyone on board and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had originally planned, but in the end she still got what she wanted. Until now, it's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around and it's even made from metal polymer composite which he can't control. Why would he be making this? Time to turn the tables. So, uh, that's another plot hole. Like, why would Heisenberg make something that he can't manipulate with his superpowers? That makes no sense. And there's another thing, like Chris uh, took Mia and Ethan from Louisiana and brought them somewhere in Eastern Europe to keep them safe uh, from the mold in Louisiana, from the media in the USA. So they cover up the situation I don't know, but he accidentally brought them here? I don't think so. You know what I think? I think that Chris did want to protect Ethan and Mia, but he also wanted to use them as bait. He knew something about them that they don't know. He knew Miranda would come for them. He probably... He Part of his team was already here, that's why he says it's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure they knew, uh, they, were, they had already eyes on her. So, so, so they brought the Winterseas here uh, under the guise of protecting them, only to use them as bait. I think that Chris had a series of uh, lapses in judgment and that's why he didn't tell Ethan he could have told you from the start but he didn't because then he would have to explain how it is that the, the one place where he takes you to be safe is still not safe right and it's on the opposite side of the world they took you from Louisiana and brought you to Eastern Europe doesn't make sense, it could have been any other place on the planet. But it's this place, where Miranda is. Or nearby where Miranda is, anyway. Very, very fishy, very, very fishy. Metal polymer composite, huh? Time to fight fire with fire. <coughs> but of course Ethan is blind to all this. Ethan is blind to a lot of stuff. I'm coming, Rose. Okay, so, ready the cannon, fire the cannon, guard. That's guarding. Sure. Ah, okay. If I aim, it's the cannon, but if I don't aim, it's a machine gun. Okay, okay, okay. Usually I don't like turret things, but I enjoy this. I don't know. It's fun. Right, and it pushes you back and takes some time to reload. I'll wait for it to reload. Right, come on. Ooh, that takes quite a while. Ooh. Okay. This 
Decepticon. Confusions. create space. I think it's more about the space than the damage. Doesn't seem to hit exactly what it needs to hit, but it creates space. or do we hold it for Miranda? I think we hold it for Miranda and use this here. What do I have to hit? It's gotta be a weak point, right? No? Just attack his face? I will. Uh, kinda. Yeah. Stan? Is they completely bugged him now and he's not taking damage or something? Oh no, he was taking damage. I did completely bug him, but he was taking damage. Uh, okay. I guess let's equip the other bullets, just the other type of ammo. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't think this is damaging him. Oh no. He's gonna make us fly again. Yeah, I'm starting to think so too. Wait, is that... Yeah, yeah, that's... The tank thing. This can't be the end for me. I must kill her. Bye 
bye. Crystal Heisenberg. Wait, he has a phone? Ethan, I heard explosions. What the hell happened? I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Wait, phone there, resolution. Ethan? Like a JPEG. Rose? Ethan! Ethan, respond! Mia? Our child. She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg on, you've lost your lead. My lead? What are you going to do? Even Miranda thinks that I don't know, Heisenberg would be an asset. Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have her. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! Calm yourself. Rose will be safe. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours. Where are you? Show yourself! Why did Rose come to be? Was it because of her parents? And you are truly a special case. But I've learned all I can from your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda! You coward! Come out and face me! Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. That's, uh... Our I will make sure to sample your blood for later. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> I need that. I've waited so long, but dreams really can. I can't wait to see my true child again. So Ethan's dead? Seems so. Captain, I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. This all happened within 24 she hours? Could fake being a corpse. Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not gonna get away with it. God damn it, when does it end? What's that, sir? The mission? All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three 
three years too long. Is he gonna drive off into the sunset? Oh. What's a badass SUV? Suits him, I guess. So BSAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, it doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. Been a while since we fought together, Captain. Ooh, that's a lot of ammo. Target locator. Hand grenade. A knife. Medicine that fully heals all the wounds. USMAI, a mid sized semi automatic gun. Fully automatic hero weapon. When was the last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turned herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at either. Spooky. I don't know, human. Head, legs, it's all the same, right? They're mold. Hey, Alpha. What's this? What does he mean? Aren't they here to stop it? Slap him? Looks pretty rough. Oh, whoa. First, we're gonna have to take that thing out. You got your back, boss. Let's get to work. Everyone, watch for hostile bioweapons. Okay, Roger. I think from here on out it's all action, so I'll take a break here and then we'll go get it. Unable to use locator. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for joining me. Bye bye.